Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Paul Leo Jr. And in today's video, I just wanted to show you something extremely simple. And this is how to actually remove, um, for instance, people's birthdays and other uh, oddball events that you don't necessarily want on your Google Calendar. So I have, I have my Google Calendar on the home screen of my phone. And I kept getting uh, <laughs> someone's uh, birthday who I was just a contact with uh, through Google and their birthday would show up and I couldn't remove it you know from the actual um, from the actual app itself on my phone so <clears throat> in order to do that to remove uh, different uh, specific reminders and uh, even holidays and so forth you can do this on your phone just go to calendar.google.com and then it's literally right there so um, once you're in the Google Calendar via the desktop site, you can just go, like you see it on the left hand side here. So the Polio Junior 2 here, those are reminders that I have, um, that I have put in myself. So those are all custom reminders. Any contacts, um, that's where like that birthdays, uh, the birthday option is. It'll say it's this person's birthday. And that was the one thing that I kept getting. I'm like, can I just get this off my calendar? just because I do not like seeing a ton of things on my calendar. And it's literally this simple. <clears throat> you go to calendar.google.com and you just uncheck what you don't want. So I always just, I leave, you can even uncheck the holidays in the United States uh, and even add other calendars. Uh, you can add other people's calendars too, you know, as long, obviously as long as they share it with you. So there's even an option there for, like for me right now, I like having just, the stuff that I personally put in. I don't need to see people's birthdays, which is under this context. I mean, maybe you like to, but there's people that I have contacts with, but I'm not personal friends with, so I don't need to know it's their birthday. And then um, anything else as far as the tasks and so forth, uh, you can just uncheck or check and that'll all be removed from, it will, it will not show up in your calendar. So if you're used to using two separate things, so, um, yeah, it's really just that simple. So even if, um, you wanted to just remove anything from <laughs> that you put in and you want to just not see anything on the calendar at all, you would just uncheck this next to your actual name. So it's really just that simple, but the birthdays, the birthday one was the one was the act, the specific one that I was dealing with. So it was literally just going to calendar.google.com and on the left pane here, uh, just unchecking it and then that person's uh, birthday disappeared as far as um, even other people that I had Google contacts with anything if their their birthdays didn't show up either so I like having a clear schedule and just the custom things that I put in so uh, yeah that's really it so thank you very much for watching this hopefully helped you it's very simple but you're just like, where the hell do I go to do this? So, and a lot of people don't use the desktop version. So they're typically just used, they're used to using the, the widget instead. So, and you can't really do this from the widget at the moment, but hope this helped you. Just go to calendar.google.com and look on the left pane and see what you have selected that will actually show up in your Google calendar. So, all right, guys, I will see you in the next one. Thank you very much for watching. Later.